bold move, challenging the longest reigning intercontinental champion in WWE history. That's who fortune favors, Troy. The bold. I suppose we'll have to see about that. I'm hoping that means you have some good news for me, and Miz has agreed to my request for a match with Gunther. Oh, no. Absolutely not. Miz giving you anything without strings? Could you even imagine? <laughs> no, but I didn't imagine having to deal with you at the airport either. Lucky day for everyone. Gunther could certainly be in the cards, but why rush into it when Miz has so many hand-picked opponents for you? Like Bronson Reed, who you'll be taking on in a non-title match next. You ready to head to the arena? This might be the first time you've ever given me good news, Troy. I can't wait to get Bronson in the ring. My goals reach no higher than the happiness of SmackDown's WWE Universal Champion. Undisputed. You left out a word there, buddy. Here comes the 330 pounder. It's a the undisputed WWE Universal Champion giving a huge opportunity to his opponent tonight. A huge opportunity would be putting the title on the line. That's ridiculous, Corey. The champ has never backed down from a challenge because he's blinded by his ego, Cole. Sooner or later, that's going to catch up to him. Gets him with the counter. Close line. Good lord. So effective. Stop after stop after stop. Putting the boots to an opponent will take the fight out of them in a hurry. And he sends him into the corner. Guys, I can't think of a worse place for. Heading up top, second row. Oh, now the top rope. Face buster from up top. Like they say, what goes up must come down, and that was a long way down. And it's a long way down from there. Uh-oh, things are getting dicey now. Back superplex! Very compromising position in a very precarious spot. Got him up! And Reed is now in a demoralizing spot. This is Reed's resolve being challenged. And now Reed is thriving off the audience. Pulled back into the hip toss. Just a perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. You gotta wonder if there's more animosity in this match than we previously thought. He gets back into the ring. Connects. He's absorbing some tough hits now. They've definitely taken from the top. Crash landing. Oh, what a kick. Delivers a well-placed hip attack. Saw that one coming. Took advantage. From the top. Oh. Blast off! Diving hammer strike! Oh, trap in the arm! Oh. And now Reed is being measured! Uh-oh! Batten down the hatches! And Reed capitalizes there. Oh, that got turned around on Reed. Not 
the position you want to be in right now. Up and over, all the way to the floor. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Here we go. This is going to be nasty. Sit up, power bar. He's getting a little batter now. It's looking like Reed's opposition is failing to rise to this challenge. Oh, stop right to the hand. He's returning fire. Hooked him up. High angle, better the pin, and the win! Yes! He breaks the pin before a one count. What a jaw-dropping show of strength this late into the match. Nice edge chop! Reed about to come crashing down. Perched up top. Oh, I mean, knee drop! And Reed is taking command of this one. Bronson Reed incessant in his approach. Check out this power. Does he get it here? He's on the ropes. The official sees it and waves off the pin. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Oh, well, you can tell he's... Yes, he didn't come here to watch him boast in time. Shit out of the next driver. Can Reed close it out? Makes the cover. Oh, shoulder up before three. Where in the world is he getting this from? His beating heart will not be stopped. Everything possible was done to win there, but it just fell short. Overwhelming offense now from Bronson Reed. Reed's a wrecking ball in motion. With the reversal. He's shown it's not. Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. And five! Thunderous! Can Reed come back from that? Two! The champion with a big win here tonight. Wait, it's Gunther! Oh, man. Here we go. You asked for this, champ. The Dark Horse called out the longest reigning Intercontinental Champion in history. And the Ring General is giving his answer. Gunther getting right in the WWE Universal Champion's face. And our so-called Undisputed Champs not doing a damn thing about it. Where the hell is he, Troy? Our general manager? He doesn't report to me. Zero interest in small talk, Troy. I want Gunther now. Do you? I mean, he was standing right in front of you and you didn't do anything about it. What are you trying to say? I'm not trying to say anything, champ. But it's all over social media. I was just reading a post from Roman Reigns that made you look like a joke. All the more reason not to keep stalling. Except there is. Our Intercontinental Champion is very important to the future of SmackDown, and Miz is off making sure that his top superstar is happy. <sighs> what now, Troy? What flaming hoop do I have to jump through for Miz to give me what both of us already want? You will be facing the Ring General's top lieutenant, Ludwig Kaiser. If I didn't know any better, I'd say Miz is doing the thing where he tries to wear me down before my next big match. Miz would never. I'm out, Troy. I'll beat Kaiser. Then Miz had better give me Gunther so we can settle this once and for all.
I find it interesting that Gunther was so quick to confront the champ last week, but now he sends out his flunky to do the fighting for him. That's why he's the ring general and you're not, Saxton. It's called strategy. Gunther does already seem to have the tactical advantage as the undisputed WWE Universal Champion is fighting for a chance to face the Intercontinental Champion, which is the opposite of how it usually works. Into a powerbomb! Well, they say everyone has a plan until they get punched in the mouth. Well, someone just threw their plan out the window. You can feel the resentment building with each stop there. Close line! What impact! And Ludwig can't find a way off the blocks. Kaiser is being worked on heavily. Oh, ouch! No way! Power bomb! No muss, no fuss on that delivery. Someone clearly doesn't want this match to go on much longer than it has to. Cross the shoulders up and gut check. And he goes for the pin. Raising the arm before one. Not even close to down and out at this point. Enable to counter. Kick to the gut. Hoisting their opponent up. And driven down in the final prayer. Referee breaks the count. Looks like a rope break. Sent into the corner. Look at that counter from Ludwig. And they failed to hit the mark. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Crash landing, powerbomb. He moved, but can he capitalize? Oh, 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 what a nasty knee lift. The close of this match is just ahead. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. And that stops whatever Kaiser intended. Oh my, what a splash! And more attacks to his core could hinder his offense. Splayed across the top turnbuckle, certainly not ideal. Shot to the back. Opponent seated on the top rope in a precarious position. Wait a second. Oh, look at the ability, athleticism, wow! Avalanche German suplex! Dropping the elbow, and Ludwig can't find a way off the blocks. Kaiser is being worked on heavily. Taking flight! What? It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring, there is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. From the apron, look out below! And he slides him back to the mat. Hey, we're all getting free tickets to the gun show. Oh, and a stomp right to the back. Ludwig could be on the verge of seeing stars. Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. And a five! Thunderous! Can that keep Kaiser down? Two count. The champ has proven himself. Oh, Imperium attacking the WWE Universal Champion. Did he really think the ring general wouldn't have a plan? This was a trap all along. And the dark horse walked right into it. Score one for Gunther. Oh, you look like you've been in a car accident, champ. <laughs> Miz wanted me to extend his deepest sympathies. That's not exactly how he phrased it on social media. I can't believe the flowers haven't arrived already. I'll have to put in a call. I just got the hell beaten out of me, Troy, in another one of Miz's traps. You sure you want to be doing this right now? 
No, no I am not. Gunther and his lackeys jumped me. I want to show them why I'm the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, up close and personal. Then you'll be happy to know that Miz has given you exactly what you want. You'll get your wish when you face Imperium next week, in a gauntlet match. The following is a gauntlet turmoil match. The rules of the match are as follows. Two superstars will start in the ring. When one superstar is eliminated, a new superstar enters. Eliminations can occur by pinfall, submission, disqualification, or countouts. The match will be won if the first entrant eliminates all other entrants in the match. The undisputed WWE. Here comes the sm There won't be any traps tonight. The WWE Universal Champion gets his hands on Imperium one by one. You say that like it's good for the champ, Saxton. How much of him do you think is going to be left by the time he gets to go there? The champ has faced down the odds from night one, Corey. That's why they call him the Dark Horse. Big splash! Boom! Just dead lifting right there. The power! Superhuman! The amount of force behind that is enough to knock a normal person out. Collision on the splash. And Giovanni's resolve might be wavering here. Vinci's not showing any capacity to fight back. From the top. Oh, oh, drop. oh it's a piercing elbow. Close line. Oh, man. Start counting, Saxton. One. Two, three, we could be here four. all day. Power. I think you're right. All oh, night long. Into the corner now. Close line in the corner. And a couple back elbows to follow. And now the pressure's mounting on him. He's going to have to dig out of this in a hurry. A uh, splash and look at the power of textbook scoop slam. Nicely done. Strikes with a kick. Oof. Connects on the kick. Uh-oh. Answering back. And Vinci isn't looking helpless anymore. He's trying to bring the fight back in this one. Vinci with the handle, Olympic slam for the win. He's able to beat a two count. Surprised to not even get a two count at this point. Oh boy, he's stalking him, watching for an opening. If this lands, it might be all over. Death Valley driver by Vinci. Vinci stamping an end to this. There's two. He's still in this fight. No telling how much surviving that will cost, though. I don't know how someone kicks out of that. I don't know how you can still be standing. That was the best weapon in the art. Springboard! Oh, just completely off target there. Brash decision-making there proved to be extremely detrimental. Can you recover from such an error? You have to wonder. He's been 
placed in the corner now. Wicked clothesline. An agile escape. Missed timing with that springboard. Quick sidestep by Vinci. Mat slam with some attitude. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Oh, trap in the arm. Oh. left in this gauntlet match. Next into the gauntlet is Ludwig Kaiser. Just look at the WWE Universal Champion. This guy's already hurting and he's only in the second fight of the gauntlet. Of course he's hurting. Vinci wasn't in that first match to win. He was looking to hurt the champ. And what do you think Ludwig Kaiser is going to do in this match? Haven't you learned never to count the... Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. F5! Thunderous! That could end Kaiser right now. Yes, Ludwig Kaiser has been eliminated. Time to hit the showers. Coming in fresh, we've got the last competitor entering the gauntlet. The next Billion oh, will win. win. This match. isn't who we expected. Where the heck is Gunther? Must be another tactical move by the ring general. I love it. Can the Dark Horse take down the surprise opponent? What's going on here? Has Ilya Dragunov joined Imperium? Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. <laughs> Thunderous! Will that stop Dragunov? Power. You gotta be kidding me. Everyone here is in shock. And now the question runs in the mind how am I gonna be able to end this? I felt the vibration of that one from all the way up the top. You gotta be kidding me. Trying to do as much damage as humanly possible. But at what cost? And he gets delivered back into the ring. Looking wobbly in the corner. Not where you want to be right now. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Neckbreaker. And Dragunov's resolve might be wavering here. And Dragunov stuck and looking for a solution. And he's able to fight Dragunov off. Now's a chance for him to get back into this match. Going way up high. Taking flight. Body splash. Close line. Oh, man, he is fired up now. Vicious right forearm. And he's soundly taking control here. He's taking charge here. Backbreaker. Straight impact on the... Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. F5! Thunderous! Going to the well again. Will it produce dividends? The ring general's master plan has failed. Hang on. Got their front behind with the Intercontinental title. And the champ is down. It's time for the Age of Imperium.
I just got a message from WWE.com. They ran a poll, and the majority of the WWE universe thinks that it's Gunther's time to rise. Maybe the WWE universe didn't see me take out two-thirds of Imperium in their hired gun. Or maybe it's that the Age of Imperium has such a nice ring to it. Epic. What do they even call your run, huh? All this time as WWE Universal Champion, has anyone ever actually said it's your era? They don't have to say it. They know. Well, good news! After that gauntlet match, Miz decided that this rivalry has had the proper buildup. So you'll be defending the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against Gunther at Night of Champions in a no disqualification match, just like you wanted. Stacking the deck against me. Must be Friday. The following is scheduled for one fall and is for the Undisputed WWE Universal Championship! The challenger is a great champion, and he hasn't come alone. The Universal Champion walks into the storm alone. Introducing the challenger from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Gunter! And his opponent from Punjab, India, weighing in at 230 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, the Scorpion, Razor B. I have a feeling we're about to see a classic, gentlemen. You can see the desire in these competitors' eyes reflected right back at them in the shine of that championship's gold. I'm calling it now. Tonight is finally the night when we see this fraud of a WWE Universal Championship run come to an end. The champ has stood up against every challenge that has come his way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You both sound like broken records protecting this guy. History has proven that the Dark Horse can overcome. Not Gunther, not tonight. He catches Gunther with a big counter. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. Oh, what a shot. Up on the shoulders. Down in a hurry. How in the world was that just done? Setting it up in the corner. Oh, boy. Looks like trouble here. Uh-oh. Did you hear that impact? He's 
in a bad way right now, guys. He has got to find a way to get out of the ring and regroup. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Impact in the corner. That corner is getting crowded and dangerous. Bam. All the momentum swinging away from Gunther. Gunther needs to cause some separation. He's up against the steel. And I can tell you that steel is anything but forgiving. And he's taking this to the outside now. As he sets it up, Byron, tell me, what's he thinking here? Michael, I'm afraid he's setting up a launching pad of sorts. Returning to the ring now. Oh! Oh, my goodness. Foot was in overdrive there, and the challenger is rocked. Climb! Go! No, 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 no! Oh, That's it, that's it! I want to look away, but I can't. A terrible mistake coming off that ladder. Powerbomb position. Fighting out. Hammering away with punches to the face. Series of reversals. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. What a counter. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Top of that turnbuckle is not where you want to be. Gunther cuts him off. Taken down with a chop block. And it's scouted. Climbing to the top rope. From the top. Whoa, look out. Soaring through the sky and crashing onto their opponent. He's got one thing on his mind with that chair, and it has nothing to do with lounging. Steel chair to the temple. Any one of these attacks could cause irreparable damage, but I don't think you can come back from this many. Oh, God, right to the cranium. And you never want to count a competitor out, but there seems to be no signs of defense right now. He's back into the ring. No clue what he hopes to find down there. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. But they are two outs acting like a cop. Sharp punch. Gunther seems unable to turn the momentum here. Gunther has to create an opportunity to retaliate. Someone's about to have a really bad night. Oh, this ends right here. Choke slam through the table. You can literally see his face leave cover. his body as he crashed through the table. I have no idea how he's going to manage to go on in this one. Kick to the gut. Hoisting their opponent up and driving them down for the final prayer. Re-entering the ring now. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. Gunther has everything working against him now. Batten down the hatches. Oh, saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Snap power slam. Muscles up there. Edward Frozen. Gonna see a new champ. He wasted no time kicking out there. What is it gonna take to put him away? It is just unbelievable. And Guther's tank is... The ring general delivering a power bomb. The champ's eyes look glazed over. The champ kicks out at two. Based on what we just saw, I think this match is far from over. We know of what that kick out cost. The champ might be running on fumes. It is just unbelievable. Oh, he grew tired of his smug attitude. The 
just a beat down. Oh, man, he is more than fired. Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. F5! Thunderous! The champ will stay champ. Two! And the champ retains. Here is your winner. And keep happening how does the wwe universal champion keep surviving impossible odds he just beat the longest reigning intercontinental champion in wwe history and he is on his way to another record now corey roman's record before we introduce our next guest let's set the stage Cody Rhodes is still the World Heavyweight Champion on Raw, providing some stability after a tumultuous period that saw several champions come and go. I don't understand why we do these recaps. Our audience watches the product. Nonetheless, I'll play ball. On SmackDown, after continuing to dominate, the Dark Horse has become the Work Horse, now holding the undisputed WWE Universal Championship for three plus years. Didn't Miz and Roman Reigns think the champion stint would only last three days? And now he's approaching Roman's record-setting run. <laughs> Unbelievable. Why don't we ask Miz about that misguided prediction right now? Please welcome our guests, the SmackDown and Raw general managers, The Miz and William Regal. First of all, I take offense to the accusation that I ever doubted my champion. I know to pick a horse, and in this case, I was behind the dark horse since day one. That's rubbish. You never wanted him to be champion, and you've done everything in your power to try to put an end to his reign. Don't insult the audience, Mike. They watch the product. That's what I've been saying. You want to do this, Regal? At least I have a cohesive show. No one can keep track of what's going on on Raw. It's like a freaking middle school play. Guys, come on. How do you even know what's happening on your show? You're too busy are filming episodes of your terrible reality show that no one watches. You just think you're better than me because you've made a living on the myth that you're some kind of technical wrestling genius. Well, I'm here to tell you, no one who matters cares. I agree with some of what you said. I am better than you. That's why they made me the general manager of the A Show. Okay, maybe we take a break, yeah? No, we're not finished here. You think Raw is the A Show? Yes, I do. But we can officially answer that question in the ring at Survivor Series. War Games! Fine, SmackDown will see you and beat you at War Games. You're pathetic. We'll see who's pathetic, mate. Okay, let's get to that break. <laughs> 